<clears throat> hey guys, welcome back. I know, like three in a row, holy fuck. I was just out and about today, I went to the flea market. Shit like that, nothing, nothing there, per usual. Fucking flea market, man. It's literally the same shit. Like, I was away from here for a couple years, like literally like two and a half years. And when I came back, I went to the flea market and it was like 90% the same shit they were selling two and a half years ago. So, needs to say that was a bust. Went to a couple other places and I, uh, so I'm going to stop at a shopper's I don't normally stop at. It's a little, not like out of town or anything, but the city's relatively large. You've got like a east side, a west side, north and south ends. And this was on the west side. It's about, you know, a 15 minute drive away. So I don't go there a lot. Not a lot over there for me to go there for, but I figured, anyway, went over and, uh, Picked up a couple couple cheapies, but goodies, to tell you the truth. A uh, couple by Davidoff. We all know Davidoff makes cheap scents. But Jesus, man, some of them are nice. Like, a lot of them are really nice stuff uh, for under $40, right? You know, most of them are about 20 bucks. These two are 20 Um Yeah, real nice scents. Anyway, let's, let's have a quick... I already sprayed the meat on one hand, so I can give you the dry down. That was a couple hours ago. Uh, but I'll show you them and tell you exactly what they what I think of them. This is Davidoff Champion. Kind of a big bottle. Big box, big bottle. Cool box, you know, picture of the... <laughs> Looks like a weight. 1,000, 2,044. Uh... Oh, there's the sticker, so I don't steal it. <laughs> uh, David off champion. Looks like a weight, like I said. Ugh. Top comes off. Uh, off the top of this, man, I get straight up citrus. And it was funny because it was in the store. It's like, no, I don't want it. You know, I. Uh, it's just another citrus scent. I don't need it. The collector in me was fighting the fucking other person in me, you know, so the, 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 the non-spender, but the collector was like, oh, you should get it. And I'm like, no, I don't need it. Anyway, store, I sprayed them both. And then I, uh, <clears throat> walked around the store for a bit. There's a hint guys, honestly, just when you spray it, don't buy it off the top. Give it. Fuck. It was 20 minutes later. I went to the washroom in the store and I ran into a couple people I know. Talk for 10 or 15, so about a half hour later, and I'm, whoa, does that ever fucking change? Went from a straight, like, fucking boom, citrus scent right off the top, man, to a fucking nice citrus spicy. I get a lot of uh, sage with them citruses and some pepper. Real nice scent, real nice scent. And it's still going strong. This is two and a half, three hours ago. It's still going strong. It has a bit of a, I'm going to say this and people are going to freak out, but a bit of an Aventus vibe to it in that mid. Uh, it's not Aventus, not even close. It's just got that same, the mix of the the woods in the at the base and the, the sage in the, in the mid and the citrus off the top give it a slight spicy pineapple -y vibe to it. But it's not an Aventus clone or anything. It's not, you know, it's just, it's got a bit of a vibe to it like that. Like a, I get like a spicy pineapple. Uh, anyway, seems to be a nice scent. Uh, I'm actually really liking that one. It was the one I didn't like at first. And uh, so that's just a, 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 a bit of advice. Don't buy something right off the top. Even if you don't like it off the top, give it a half hour. Grab a cup of coffee, a smoke, something. Give it a half hour and fucking smell it again. Uh, the next one was, uh, I liked right from the top, and I liked the whole thing so far. Uh, Davidoff Adventure. This is, yeah, this is, this is nice. Uh, a lot of citrus off the top again, but it was, I don't know what it was. There was just something about, well, first off, the bottle was fucking neat. Oh, get that cap off. Yeah, it's, it's got, you know, it's, this is going to sound kind of funny. It might put a couple people off, but it's got a medicinal smell to it at the top. 
but a, but not an overly it's really nice i can't explain it and it a lot of citrus off the top again but it has like a pepper some spice and, and some lavender in there off the top too and it dries down into a beautiful blend of like i mean beautiful blend holy fuck of, of i'm gonna say like cedar wood and musk and some vetifer beautiful scent beautiful scent again it's going strong and we're going on like i said two and a half three hours later like i could still just smell them both from here i don't know which one i'm smelling more as i was driving i think it was the champion i really wasn't paying attention but uh yeah not not bad for 20 bucks a piece i gotta tell you that like i said david off as a house doesn't get a lot of respect you know because they don't you know, and they're, they're, they'll be fair. They're not Dior. They're not YSL. You know, they're not Chanel. I mean, they're not, you know, but they're... Some of their shit's not bad, man. I will say both of them off the top are very synthetic. And I know I don't say that a lot because, but these ones, like I said, uh, especially Adventure, like I said, it gives almost a medicinal vibe, but it's still very nice. Very, very different in a in a nice way all right guys that's it just a quick little pickup video uh rocking that just cavalli i was right i still kind of like it a little softer than i remember but we'll get into that review there at the end of the week Hey anyway, guys yeah hope you're having a good start to your week peace love be good to each other